at the instance shown, so in this picture, the particle's distance from the wire, d, is equal to 1.92 centimeters. We are asked, what is the magnitude of the force on the particle due to the current? Before we start this problem, we should write down what we are asked to find. We need to find force, the magnitude of the force. So this is going to be the net force on the particle. To find force, we need to use the formula for force, which is that the force is equal to charge times velocity times the magnetic field. Before we do this though, we know our charge, Q, we have our velocity, however we do not have our magnetic field. So what we need to do first is find our B. And to find our B, we are going to use the formula for magnetic field on a wire. And this is going to be B subscript W for wire is equal to the constant U naught times the current I divided by two pi times R. Our U naught never changes, it is always four pi times 10 to the negative seven tesla meters over amps. This is, this is being multiplied by our current, which is 374 milliamps or 0 0.374 amps. This is being divided by two pi times our distance, r, r is the distance here, and our distance is 1.92 centimeters or 1.92 times 10 to the negative two meters. After we carefully plug this into a calculator, we are gonna get approximately that B is equal to 3.9 times 10 to the negative six Teslas. Now, we have our B value here, we have our Q here, and our V here. So we can now solve for our F of N. We're given our Q to be 4.8 times 10 to the negative 19 coulombs. We're also given our velocity to be 2.63 times 10 cubed meters per second. Then we found our magnetic field to be 3.9 times 10 to the negative six. After we carefully plug this into our calculator, we are gonna get F of N, which is our answer, being equal to approximately 4.9 times 10 to the negative 21st, and our units is in newtons because force is measured in newtons. That is our answer.